Well, guys, we've been trying to make our way around uh, Hollis, but of course we've run into several roadblocks. We're near Silver Lake State Park. We're on Wood Lane right now, but of course Wood Lane is blocked off. Take a look at this behind us as soon as this truck passes by. That is what's blocking it. That is a telephone pole that is down right in the middle of the road. Uh, now, earlier we got stuck on Federal Hill Road uh, by a tree that had fallen onto some power lines up that way. Crews did make quick work of that, but here we are at another roadblock, and this is far from the only one. Again, we've been driving around town. We've seen several roadblocks on Rocky Pond Road, Apple Lane, Wood Lane, Federal Hill Road, just to name a few. Neighbors tell us they are without power. At last check, Eversource says there are roughly 700 households in the Hollis area that are without power. All of these roadblocks are making it nearly impossible for crews or anyone else to get anywhere. God bless the guys that have to clean it up because that's that's going to be a, a big project for them. But, uh, you know, it kind of stinks. We have to find a, a totally different way because I guess Silver Lake's down now, too. So, yeah. Now, crews are working quickly to clean up the damage and clear the roads. Uh, but if you know anything about this area around Silver Lake State Park, you know that it's very heavily wooded and this could take some time. So we're going to continue making our way around Hollis, checking out some of the other damage. Uh, we'll bring you another live report at 730. But for now, live in Hollis, Scott Cook, WMUR News 9.